This is a dangerous scam that is going around that a scammer bot could use. I'm gonna explain you exactly what this is and why you have to watch out for this extremely dangerous scam inside of the Fleet of Facility Trading Post. This is a really nasty and annoying scam inside of the Fleet of Facility Trading Post. There is one good thing. The owner of Fleet of Facility, Mr. Windy, could actually fix this because it is a bug. I'm gonna explain you right now how it works and how you can prevent from being scammed. Right now, you're seeing the cam of the victim. So basically, this is the person that is going to get scam then the scammer actually sends you a trade now the victim doesn't even know this is a scammer so he just decides to accept the trade then the scammer actually puts whatever hammer or gem he wants inside of the trade and for example right now that is a dark ghost gem and a pumpkin slice hammer after that the scammer exits out the trade right now you're probably thinking why is he even exiting the trade like isn't he gonna scam or something that is where it gets really dangerous because you don't even know he's actually scamming after that the scammer actually sends you another trade and this is really where the scam actually starts to find place did you see what happened right here or did you not it happened so quickly that you could not actually know that this is basically the scam the scammer never put the pumpkin slice and the dark ghost inside of the trade but it is already right there you don't understand it let me explain real quick the scammer created a lag spike with his internet and because of that the hammer and the gem are still inside of the next trade so the pumpkin slice and the dark ghost are not in the trade but they are there so it's basically a picture but they are not there. So what it comes down to is that if right now the victim puts items inside of the trade and he accepts the trade, that means he is not getting the pumpkin slice and the dark ghost. But the victim, if he puts items in the trade and he accepts it, that means all the items that are from the victim are going to the scammer. So the scammer just gets a bunch of hammers and the victim doesn't get anything and now the really bad thing is i have seen so many people already doing this scam inside of the trading post and if this keeps up it means the whole trading post will just be flooded with people trying to scam other people now it could be that you're wondering what is going to happen when the victim right now is going to accept the trade but there is nothing that he is putting inside of the trade himself now the victim actually accepted the trade and he is supposed to get a pumpkin slice and a dark ghost now, what you're going to see that he is going to go to his inventory to see if he has the pumpkin slice and the dark ghost gem. So he, of course, can use it for fluid facility match or just to have on his back. So he accepts. And of course, what you're doing next, you're going to your inventory to check if it is actually there. And then he cannot find it. Now, this guy right here actually got scammed. Now, of course, this is an example. So if this was an actual person and he actually put something in the trade, he would have been scammed scammed and he would have not gotten his items back but the worst part of this all is that the slice hammer and the dark ghost gem are not there in the trade they are there but it's at the same time not there at all what you're seeing right now is the actual scammer perspective so this is how it looks like for the scammer and of course this could also be like a bot so if this wasn't a person this person could just be scamming all day long whoever this person wanted to and right here you can actually see that the scammer is trying to accept the trade but the scammer caused lag on purpose with his internet so he is not accepting the trade yet but then he actually keeps the hammer which is so weird and that is not supposed to happen because you can see his inventory right now of the scammer and he still has the pumpkin slice and the dark ghost inside of his inventory which is not not supposed to happen at all now the owner of roblox fleet of facility actually could fix this this roblox fleet of facility scam can really not be out here at all if this is going to be still here for the next couple of weeks a lot of people inside of roblox fleet of facility are actually going to get scammed but how can you prevent this from happening to you the only thing i can really say to prevent this from happening to you is do not trade with people you do not trust and do not trade with one person twice that is just going to be it for like a couple weeks because i hope this will get fixed because if it doesn't there is so many people going to get scammed and this is also one of the most tricky and one of the most sneaky ways to get scammed because you most of the time 
are not even knowing that you're getting scammed right at that moment. The only thing you really need for this scam is really laggy internet and you can make that happen in so many ways. So really you have to watch out for this scam and just know that there right now is not a scammer bot doing this there is actually a real person doing the scam i would call this way more dangerous and way more scary than the scammer bot that was in the trading post of roblox fleet of facility before the sad part of this all of course is the owner of roblox fleet of facility trading post is of course mr windy and he never really updates it's gonna be really necessary that fleet of facility trading post is going to get a bug fix because if this is going to be around like i already said before then a lot of people and innocent people most most of all are going to get scammed and that is not good i really hope this warning is clear do not trade with people you do not trust and do not trade with people twice at the same time those are the really good signs to see that this person is probably going to scam you and has something you do not want at all i really hope roblox fleet of facility is going to get an update really quick so this is going to be gone make sure you tell everyone that is trading that there is a scam going around if you like this video, make sure you subscribe, and if you find this useful, make sure you subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Make sure you click right here to watch another video, and I'll see you there. Peace.